If you guys destroy us on our mic'd up match, oh no, please, <laughs> please. Bro, this, this can literally drive on top of our robot probably, like honestly. <laughs> Like get, get the ramps right, just right. Who's driver? I am. Okay, we need to talk. We need to talk strategy. Okay. Um, I'm just gonna stay in the channel. Yeah. Yeah. yeah okay. So after all, gotta get that channel. You can't let them. Nothing. These if guys. They drive backward. You have to be in between them and the natural bar. Okay. And just even if they leave, just stay over there. And don't let them block okay, so out. Don't let them touch the natural bar and don't let them go to the channel. Yeah. 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 Just I'll, shut okay. them off. I'll be on your side of the field. I'm gonna match them for us. If okay. you so, if you can keep them locked down okay. in your corner, yeah. we have a D score. Okay. If you can lock one of them in the same place. 50% of the time, the other team will be in the same zone as they are. Okay. And the second that hits, we're in their goal and their goal's done. Okay. So, right. if you can lock one of them, I don't care which one it is, okay. if you could lock down whichever one you can lock down, if you lock down one of them, we have a decent shot. Okay. All right. But they're both pretty good. Okay. Yeah, just gotta get the deadlocks. Probably wedge over first. Yes, we're gonna wedge over. So, straight out of auto. Yeah. I have a thing. Do they're we know what camp. autos they have? No. Okay. Uh, I believe they. Uh, I don't see any climbs on there. It's A tier balance. They have A tier, but I don't see any. They do. It's probably wings. It's, it's, the, it's with their wings. Both it's, of them it's, are wings. It's a wing. Uh, one of them is with their wings, and the other is like A tier climb. Uh, right. Yeah, I'm gonna have to hit that. All right, we're pumped. We have a new battery. Yeah. I think the other is Neil. Neil? Maybe. Oh, it's like a Neil climb. No, 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 yeah, no, the other is Neil. Oh, my gosh. Wait, so when so, are we going to get it? One, so we lose one. The, the wing climb is questionable, but expect a double A2 from them. OK. So, okay. We're going to so lose we, our climb. We so need Dwayne, to we probably lose auto, too. Dwayne, no. you need a decent all. Yeah. Okay. Oh, gosh. Hey. Is the, is the A tier horizontal, it's like, is it like good? Is it, is it consistent? The, the Neil climb? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Expect an A tier double. Okay. So we're going to play from behind, probably, both climb and auto. You have to win the acorn back. Like, cook cut acorn back. You have to yeah. cook them. Okay. If you don't cook them, we're going to get cooked. Yeah. Did you check the systems before the match? No. No, not the one point auto. We I checked climb. Check climb is fine. Just run everything? No. That's fine. It's fine. No, you use air. Did you pump? Yeah, we yeah. pumped. We pumped. Both tanks? Yes. Both tanks. Batteries? Yes. That's Hi, it. Dwayne. Yeah. 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 Dwayne, if you go in their goal again and you only D score one acorn, we're actually going to lose. Yeah, I know. They have a blocker, right? Oh, do they? Do they? Do we want them to use that thing? They're one of one of one of them has an elevated shooter. I trust you. Okay. okay. All right. Uh, did you give pump to Anish? Oh, it pumps right there. Oh, I got mine. I got mine. All right. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Is that our pump? Is that our pump? Yeah, that's our pump. Uh, middle one. Split the match with. Huh? Yeah. Split the match with. I'm throwing, I'm throwing. Make good choices. 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 Is one of your? Is this your control? Oh no! Uh, this is someone else's controller. They actually like screwed down these field perimeters, so these are good. Can I unplug? And I've done yeah. your first field. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Oh no! Keep them on that side. We'll split. Uh, okay. We gotta restart it until it like is not white anymore. Wait, Joseph. They're, they're running elevated shooting match loading. Our partner's not going to be able to push them off. Okay, that's, as long as they sit there and lock them up. They're match loading, you're good. Yeah. If they match load, we should win. Yeah. I hope Gears is right. What is Gears? Oh, oh yeah. I think you have it, Dwayne. If, 
going. You escape their deadlocks. Yeah. They're gonna want to pin you. It's yeah. good for them to pin you. Yeah. You cannot let them pin you. Uh, 40 seconds. Remember, in take down when you're climbing, line up the climb. You can't miss the climb this time. Yeah. Yeah, the wiping them down helped a lot. Okay. Yeah, I know, I, I noticed. 30 seconds. I'm turning on the controller. Wow, fast, okay. fast loads coming out. Are we sure that there's a setup right? Yeah. Uh, I don't know if two, it's right. One auto. Okay. Ours is slightly off. Oh, we're good? Yes. All right. All right, we're down. We're down tribals. Okay. Well, there's nothing to wedge over. Um, you want me to score? I think we want to score. You want to score immediately? You know what? We might want to pull. All right. Pull, pull, pull. Oh, sorry. sorry. Yeah, that's illegal. Okay. Shoot. I can't move. I can't move. I can't. Uh, All right, they are not double downing. Right. You got to get them down there, down yeah, there, yeah. in their channel. That's their blue. Yeah. That's their blue. Good. Okay, come back. Close this open. Yeah. Oh God, get out of there. Uh, yeah. Get out of getting, getting out. Getting out now. Do you score their thing? Yeah. In there, done. Yeah, done. Close is open. You want a bull one? A... No, 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 just no. go. You're in a deadlock. Okay, get out. out. Getting out. All right. Okay, good, it, done. It. Joseph, Joseph! They are not double zoning. I dropped one, I dropped one. They're about to be double zoning. Come back for the right. deep score. Want to pull one? No, no, no. You need to get a try ball, bro. Joseph, Joseph! Yep. Okay, it's about to be 30 seconds. Yep. T score. No, no, no. Okay, okay, okay. They're, they're touching my thing. We're entangled. We're entangled. Get out of there. I'm trying, I'm stuck. I'm stuck, I'm stuck. Get out, I'm stuck, get I'm out. stuck, I'm stuck. Wayne, try something. You only have seven seconds. We just lost. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. You had one match load, you were saying, Yeah. We just lost. Oh. Yeah. I want to call that freaking climb. Yeah. I mean, that. you can force an opponent into a penalty when it is match effective. I believe. Is that the case? I don't know. How? We're up by. But we we lost auto. We lost auto. They have three more in the zone. No, we lose. So we're up by. I don't. I don't. Four. We lost auto. We lost auto. Yeah. I'm gonna oh, argue climb. Yeah. I, it, it's kind of a legit call because like you can't get entangled with us in the last three seconds. I was touching the short barrier, but like I don't know. If we would have gotten that climb, we would have won. Yeah. And if they risk getting entangled with us in the last thirty seconds, we would have won. I don't think so. We lose auto. And they have because they spent the last the ten seconds while their partner was tying us up. So I mean, my take on that is. Like, yeah, they technically did touch the, uh -huh. the bar in the last 30 seconds. We're like, you were entangled with each other. We have uh, a yeah. metal tipping entanglement and damage may occur as a part of normal gameplay with the bar. Oh, G. G13. SG11 states in a match affecting scenario, it would go to the offensive robot. It would go. It would go. So, my take is you were entangled as a part of normal gameplay. You were doing everything you could to get apart from each other. And unfortunately, that just sort of happens. Sometimes. I don't think it matters, though, because you can force your opponent into a penalty. Yeah.
What? No, we're we're red. We're red. We're red. Oh, I'm sorry. Uh, oh my gosh. Okay. I'm sorry. The colors. Uh, yeah. I mean, my my view is I don't I don't think that was an SG11 violation. I think both robots are doing everything they can to get out of the entanglement situation. I think strictly by the rule book, it has to be ruled an SG11 violation because in match affecting scenarios, you can force your opponent into a penalty. So, what you're talking about is the opposing elevation bars, guarding points may be, if no opponent robots are in the process of elevating, then it's most likely incidental to the moment contact. It is unlikely to be match affecting and should only be considered a minor violation. Yeah, I mean, my, my, my view is... Are, are you talking about the red box there? Or um, what's the violation? Yeah, no, I'm, I'm asking you. Yeah, oh, um... So, wow. we got yeah. coming in oh. busting, they go up, so if, if an egregious violation results in opponent damage or severely impedes an opponent's elevation, where is, then... Where is the one that Anish has that... Are you talking about you can't force your opponent into a penalty? If it's match affecting, like, you can. We did this at a... Uh, uh, that's G17. G17? G17. Oh, no, uh, G16. G16 is holding. G15 oh, is forcing the opponent into a penalty. So, we like totally would have made that call so if they hadn't entangled us. G15, intentional strategies that cause an opponent to break a rule are not permitted. I don't I don't think there was an intentional strategy yeah. that caused an opponent to break a rule there. I don't think that was. I don't know what it is. Yeah, but it's not legit. If, I mean, I gotta... Let's hold off. We're having a discussion. I'm happy to talk to you. Okay. Can I see The thing is... We got entangled right next to our short man. Yeah. We were right here. Yeah. We were going that way. It was like 30 seconds. We were trying to hit our climb. They decide to come in here and risk getting themselves entangled. Okay. So let's let's start from you got entangled. Yeah. Can we agree that when you got entangled, they were not violating SG11? They, they weren't contacting anything. I don't anything. know. They, Maybe they were contacting that short barrier, but I can't tell. Okay. So I don't know. I, I don't think they were. Okay. So let's start from that. You got entangled. Entanglement sometimes happens as a part of normal gameplay without violation. That's G13B. Uh -huh. From that point when you were entangled, you were both doing everything you could to get apart from each other. And I don't think there was any, you know, the, the clause that we're talking about um, impeding your hanging in SG11. Yeah, you're good, good, thank you. Um, if an egregious violation results in opponent robot damage or severely impedes your elevation. I, mean, I don't think that was an egregious violation. I think okay. you got in the entanglement situation as a, an incidental part of normal gameplay, and from that point you were doing everything you could to get a part of uh -huh. It's just, like, we only lost by two points and that hang would have given us 20, and they got us entangled and prevented us from hanging. Yeah, I mean... I just don't understand. I think that happens. Sometimes. I don't understand what we're supposed to do because, like, we're sitting here in our corner. There's a motor port from your robot that's that's entangled around what? their standoff. Yeah, so this motor you know, port this, this is, this is just one of those things. Like, I think, unfortunately, entanglement happens sometimes. All right. Yeah. So it says if the force situation becomes match affecting in favor of the building team. That's the rule I was looking for. If a team causes their opponent to break a rule, but they didn't cause you to break no, a rule. No, we caused them to break a rule. Right. Exactly. So if a team causes their opponent to break a rule. Right. So but this rule is about what if you, you cause or what if they cause you to break a rule? That's not what happened. No, here. we caused them to touch no, like, the bar, right? Right. If a team causes their opponent to break a rule. Right, but they didn't cause you to break the rule. You didn't break the rule. How we caused them. If, right. if a team causes their opponent to break a rule, we're the team, they're the opponent, the head referee will simply not enforce this penalty on that opponent. Right. It will be considered minor violation. That's what it is right now. Yeah. Maybe, if you even call it a minor. However, if the force situation becomes match affecting in favor of the guilty team. In favor of the guilty team, meaning which it you, is. you caused them to break the rule. Is my reading. No. No. I mean, what... The, so, wait, which one's the guilty team? My, my read is the guilt. The guilty team is you, not that you violated a rule. I, I agree that wording is a little awkward, but 
my, what, I don't think my that's interpretation right. of what that's trying to say is if like red causes blue to break a rule. The guilty team is the one that's breaking the rule. We didn't break any rule. Uh, the guilty team. Bobbin. No, but we wouldn't. That, but, but, it doesn't make any sense but, that we would be what? considered guilty by forcing them into a public. Yeah, that's two corners. I think in. your interpretation that's two corners kind of in. violates the spirit of that rule because then that's a situation where you can force it into a public. Do you do you see what I'm where I'm coming Only from? Only if there? it's match effect. Well, yeah. I mean, if it wasn't match effecting, there would be no penalty in the first place. What I think he's trying to say is that you were entangled and you ran into our you forced your opponent. Yeah, so I, I I mean, if if there were a situation where you could force your opponent into a penalty and it was still a DQ for them, that would violate the spirit of that rule, in my opinion. Do you, do you see what I mean there? Yeah, okay. So, unfortunately, I think this is just one of those really close incidental cases. I don't, I don't think there's a major violation here. Um, have I have I answered your questions to your yeah. satisfaction? Are we good? So, so wait, hold sure. on. Do, do we have a weapon? This, this uh, is the fun part. Okay. okay. So this is ruled right now as incidental or momentary contact, right? Uh, are you looking at G? G S G eleven. Uh, my my take is S G eleven doesn't apply because you dragged him into it during an incidental. Uh, tangled as Is this count did, all right? Did, did we get this a, is right. Yeah, I double checked. Yeah. Yeah. We're, we've like triple checked the count. We're sure that's the result because it's a close match. Wait, yeah. I don't. Okay. Tri balls in blue goal. One, two, three, four. Yeah, that's huge. Dang it. Okay, well. All good? Yeah. All right, thanks all good. Thank you Everyone for. Thank you. Yeah. That's what I'm here for. Uh, okay. It was literally our intake motor wire. They yeah. got their standoff up in our in. Yeah. Are we actually third? In good job, guys. Good job. Yeah. Well, that's just what happened. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Well, everyone loses their mic'd up match, right? So we're good now. Okay. <laughs> They entangled us, bro. We had them. We had them. I don't know. There needs. We need to find a way to argue this. I don't know. Properly. The SG11 enforcing. They never call it. They never call it, and then some of them always call it. Like in Hollywood, definitely a DQ. But here, not a not a DQ. It's like so. It was the same thing with the tipping point platforms. It just is. Who's second? Uh, Jackson Jar. Oh, shoot. Where's the third team? Did they draw? Yeah, let me see. Let me see. This video on fun is brought to you by viewers like you and also in partnership with the following. The Robotics Education and Competition Foundation provides fantastic programs for students from elementary school all the way through college. These include VEX, Aerial Drone Competition, Online Challenges, JROTC, Girl Powered, Scholarships, Certifications, and so much more. To discover these exciting opportunities, visit RECF.org and get connected. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and ring the bell to stay up to date on our new videos. Keep the conversation going and provide your input to our content. Most live shows can be found on the First Updates Now YouTube channel, live competitions at twitch.tv slash firstupdatesnow, and join our Discord at discord.gg slash firstupdatesnow. Check our other social offerings on TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, and Twitter.